Hello everybody, I'm Hamun Kelaveri and I'm here with another tutorial. It's due to we learn something about Marvelous Designer and um, by trying to create a simple pillow inside this software. As you're watching here, we are using Marvelous Designer. Marvelous Design is one of the best things is happening inside this world because um, it's about um, creating and simulating um, 3D objects inside a very good category which is called um, cloth and you're able to simulate shirts t-shirts trousers and whatever you think inside the classes uh, category and it's really easy as you're watching here our uh, work uh, our workspace is divided on two different um, windows altogether one of these is tr 3d perspective view as you're watching your uh, able to uh, scroll and move inside this 3d scene and the other side you're able to you have a you're able to connect your uh, plans and your shapes and uh, actually this window is called um, 2d plan and you're watching you're able to watch all of your uh, assets and and your models in um, the 2d shapes and actually it's your main plan for your project um, the first of all uh, we should I uh, we should create a simple shape our base shape um, to create our pillow as you're watching here we have some shapes one of these is rectangle the other side is um, ellipse um, depends on you which your that you want to create circle or ellipse uh, for example if you hold control uh, shift sorry if you hold shift and um, click and drag you're able to create a circle and the other side if you want to create uh, create a simple ellipse you're able to click and drag it with no shortcut and you no know, command which you're able to create it uh, um, usually I, I were to create a simple pillow with um, um, a simple rectangle and make a square and uh, depends on you and your plan i really in my opinion i think a square is more cute and uh, more beautiful so i hold shift and click and drag to make a simple a square okay as you're watching we made it and created and it's done and um, when you create your um, 2d plan and your base shape um, it appears on your 3d perspective view so we need the other shape to um, connect them and connect the border of them and by sewing um, two surfaces all together we are able to simulate a simple pillow or whatever you think so just pay attention choose your base object and on um, perspective view just hold on a scroll and just rotate it okay and move it and the other side just pay attention and after again choose it and hold um, control and press C and now hold control and press V it's a same shortcut and uh, place it um, on, on the last object we made it replace them all together and now just go on same and move it down and just choose one of them and move it here okay it's done um, we just did it and um, just connect them and make them okay so just go on sewing press N now choose this edge to this edge just um, just pay attention here as you're watching here our pattern is not cool here they are um, crossing all together so it's not a cool pattern to connect them just pay attention just it, sh it should be perpendicular and towards all together and now this pattern is cool and um, it's one of the best things is happening and one of the important points um, that we should um, try to do that so click and now here on 3D perspective view, you're watching here, we place them all together and we should do it for all borders in these object, options and objects. 
okay it's done and again now you're able to move it move it up and uh, for better connection press n and uh, connect them all together it's done okay and uh, for this okay it's done and now just uh, pay attention just press space to simulate and connect them all together it's one of the best things happen is happening inside this software and uh, I'm so excited about happening and uh, press space and watch the 3d view okay they're connecting all together and gonna make some uh, noises some uh, drops dropping on the floor okay we did it okay and for um, sub simulating you're able to again um, press your space okay as you're watching here we have a um, very good cloth very good um, texture on the other side the model is um, almost realistic and uh, if you want to make some details on your model you're able to make some internal polygon patterns to make more noises and uh, just go on internal polygon and for example click on the first shape and just here and this side double click okay it's done now we can uh, make some fold angle and fold as trying to make more noises just click on these um, internal polygons and hold control and hold shift and uh, click on them and you're watching here we have two different options uh, fold strain and fold angle it can be um, more or less in your project you're able to try it uh, I think it's cool uh, fold strain is completely um, is attraction is it make a um, bigger attraction for your clothes because it makes some seams and some um, actually details just press uh, space and you're watching here it's gonna be more noisy okay and the other side you're watching here the pillow is falling down and um, doesn't have enough air uh, we want to make it um, much bigger and puffy so choose all of our uh, objects Parts. For example, one of these for uh, downside, as you're watching here, I for um, I make a pressure because it's gonna be the downside. I make a negative pressure. For example, negative five. And for this pre um, this part, because it's the upper side, upper object, I would rather to make a bigger pressure on the positive number. For example, five. And now I were to press space and just pay attention to this object. It's gonna be much puffy okay gonna be wow <laughs> I think the pressure is really big it's gonna be on 2 and yeah, negative 2 now again I try to simulate it it's cool it can be better um, I think it's zero you was try it and um, just um, try different numbers to get your best result now try okay it's gonna be <laughs> it's flying okay and Okay. and the other side just pay attention you're able to um, click and drag and make some um, noise by yourself for example just pay attention it's gonna be move down move up okay it's gonna be puffy 
more and more okay 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 go up upper okay it's done now just uh, move it down or less number is better and just fold it and click and drag okay it's done we made it and it's completely cool and uh, if you want to make much more detail you can try to fix it and uh, with some sewings and um, internal polygons you can increase your uh, details uh, and it can be very cool and just in the end of the tutorial I should say um, when, you, when you're creating your 3D model on Marvelous Designer you're able to um, apply and assign any texture uh, you like as um, by default your model can should be uh, unwrapped and uh, fortunately inside Marvelous Designer you are able to create your 3D model and it's unwrapped by default hope you enjoy and like it please subscribe to our channel on YouTube and follow me on Instagram and Telegram hope you like and enjoy it goodbye